<laughs> All right, this is gonna be scary. Hey everyone, Wonderbot here, and welcome back to Slay the Spire. It looks like the uh, score cap on this one is real high, 2,000 points. I can barely crest 1,000. Uh, then again, I never play well. Anyway, so we've got Insanity, Night Terrors, and Hoarder. This'll be interesting, so we get 50 cards, and then it's going to give us more. Every time I pick a card, it's going to give me three of each kind. So let's take a look at what horrors we have. You know what? I shouldn't look at this. I should just go. Uh, huh. I should probably go up this way. Double bonfire? Yeah. Let's do that. Double bonfire, get some maybe upgrades here and there. I don't know, man. <laughs> this is a mess. Die, die, die. Distraction. Set up Wraith form. Dagger throw. Loose prepared. Use Wraith form. Use concentrate, which does nothing for me. What? Oh. Hold on. Huh. I'm, um... I'm not sure about that. I don't know if I like the new Wraith form. That's gonna throw me off like nobody's business. I mean... Okay, no, it's not bad. I'm just not used to it. Alright, let's do prepared, loose concentrate, bullet time, infinite blades, blur, wraith form, outmaneuver, endless agony, endless agony. I, because you lose so much. I mean, it might be worth it. I. I don't know. Losing all that dexterity is scary, though. I... I don't know. I... I don't know. I mean... It'll probably be fine. I'm just going to be kind of confused about that for a while. Honestly, it's probably worth it in short-term fights. It's not worth it in long-term fights. Because, yeah, the intangible decays, so you pretty much have three turns of no damage. And after that, you quickly become crappier and crappier. Anyway, so I'm going to start upgrading cards. Specifically, infinite blades. I have an idea, which is offset some of the deck nonsense by just having a shit ton of infinite blades. Is this a good idea? Probably not. Let's see. Do I do accuracy or noxious fumes for this one? Probably accuracy and defend and concentrate's just gonna burn all of my cards anyway. We doesn't really help here. Another infinite blades, noxious fumes, die, 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 and shivs. I guess I'll just hold on to quick slash. I don't know. This will be interesting. This whole this whole day is a mess. 
I woke up and it was 86 degrees in my apartment. I totally missed the fact that, whatever, who cares. Uh, I totally missed the fact that uh, I had terror in my hand. Anyway, uh, yeah, I woke up, it was 80 degrees, wildly uncomfortable. Not happy about that. Oh well. Ooh, adrenaline, helpful. Only one energy, but you know what? I'll take one energy. Let's pop the die, die, die. I could have done cloak and dagger. We'll hold cloak and dagger for the next round. Um, I've just got a billion things that I'm doing and I'm up to, and eh, not enough time to play all these games. Unfortunately, this is the sad reality of. Let's see. Do we now? Nah, just go for the energy for next round. Hold on to blur. Because, yeah, that frailty is but Well-laid plans, well-laid plans. Outmaneuver. Blur. Get that set for the next round. We'll just do that shiv and prepared. Which, oh. You draw, then you discard. It would be nice if it was the reverse so you could scum it. But whatever. Yeah, this actually has some decent... Decent cards in the uh, in the mix. It just needs some like strength gen, or maybe just more accuracy. We'll see. Okay, endless agony, endless agony. Shiv, poison stab, bouncing flask. I guess I could have actually done sneaky strike to just instant give him. Whatever. Who cares. But yeah, I'm, I'm going to try and stay away from anything that isn't Shiv-related. Because if I can get a, an insane number of... We do have a thousand cuts, but it just doesn't show up often. Whereas... Another infinite blades. Two Shivs a turn. This is going to hurt a bit. I don't know. I don't know where this is going to go. <sighs> Probably not the best spot. Okay. I could concentrate. Yeah. Let's do that. That gets me a grand finale. Now that's a card I should probably actually get rid of. Why did I set up Grand Finale now that I'm thinking about it? That was kind of pointless. Because it doesn't give me a, a draw bo bonus for the next round. Well, that's unfortunate. Yeah, I'll probably get rid of Grand Finale. Oh, I'd like the accuracy bonus, because that would get me t three accuracies in my deck. But three malaises. I gotta go with the accuracy. No, I've also got arrested a bonfire. I'm too wounded. Because we've got mid-bosses coming up and some other things. Okay. Am I too wounded for the mid-boss? You know what? Let's go for the extra bonfires. Smithing up more cards seems like a good idea. Infinite Blades. Infinite Blades. Blind. Cloak and Dagger. I'd love to use those accuracies, but I no can do. So in response to yesterday, uh, I put out an episode that had, uh, that was only, what, 15 minutes long? I apologize that some of these episodes might end up being a little short, um, but at this point, after so many episodes of Slay the Spire, uh, I will admit I'm starting to, I'm not checking out on the series, but like, the views have dried up a little bit, and you know, I've got a billion other games to play. And so it's a little harder to, to go for the piercing whales. They're helpful. End up with a lot of them. But that's okay. A toolbox will be nice. We'll just do this. I could just hold on to the grand finale. I'm just going to hold on to the grand finale, though the chances of me drawing my entire deck are... Slim to non-existent. Alright. Uh, let's see, what do I have? Okay. 
Bouncing Flask, Outmaneuver. Shiv, Shiv. Not great. Keep holding on to this. Go from there. But it's just kind of one of those where this is this is one of those series that is probably lived too long on my channel. Um, and I, I personally don't mind it so much. I do generally enjoy this game quite a lot. You concentrate. Those shivs just aren't going to do, do enough damage anyway. There we go. That's what I was looking for. And keep holding on to Grand Finale. Chances are I'm not going to get through my deck, but meh. Accuracy, accuracy. Defend, shiv, shiv. Keep holding on to Grand Finale. But yeah, th this is just a series that is has lasted uh, too long-ish. And so, it's not that I dislike it. It's just that, you know, I've been playing it for... What? Six months now? Give or take? Uh, and so, my interests haven't moved too much, but my... My focus has moved a little bit. Let's see, I could upgrade the shivs, but I think I'm actually going to upgrade... Thousand cuts with the shivs. That's even more damage. Remove a card from my deck. Lose seven HP. Yeah, I'm gonna get rid of grand finale. I know I was holding on to it, but that's a card. My deck is too large to justify having it. Max HP plus five. So I'm immediately going to spend it, healing up to full before this boss. Okay. So we have Infinite Blades, Infinite Blades, and Accuracy. I don't know if Accuracy or Terror were the better choices there. Okay. Wraith Form? Wraith Form. Okay, so that gets me some extra energy. Sneaky Strike is also garbage. I'll have to get rid of that. But this guy is going to hurt. We kind of always knew that that this guy was going to hurt, though. I've got the Dex Potions. Uh, let's see, do I do Alchemize? Blur. Alchemize me an Artifact. I'll just dex up a little bit. I think I'll be fine. Unfortunately, uh, I believe Wraith Form just makes it so you lose dexterity every single turn, period. Which, I almost wish Wraith Form would just make it so that... I don't know. I don't know how I, how I wish Wraith Form worked. It's an interesting question. I, I don't know. Let's catalyst him up. Do I bother with the Endless Agonies? I don't know. No. I, I don't have Strength Gen on this. Oh, no, I should have used the Endless Agonies because they... they sorry, I mixed Endless Agony up with the with Rage. Hold on to the Piercing Whale. I think he's about to hit me. Yep, there it is. Infinite Blades, Cloak and Dagger, Cloak and Dagger, Shiv, 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 Shiv. Deadly Poison. There we go. I guess I'll hold on to Backflip. This isn't working so bad. Terror might have been the better idea than one of those accuracies, now that I'm thinking about it. Do I get multiple? Yeah, I'll get multiple die die dies. And we I'm gonna get internal feather. Because that'll offset the full heal from bonfires. Okay, very strong mystery machine up the right. A lot of shops. Versus. A small fortune in bonfires. I 
But then again, I can do a small fortune in bonfires down this way. I barely have any relics, so let's let's try gutsing this direction. Okay, infinite blades, infinite blades, escape plan, jack of all trades. Enlightenment, which really doesn't help the way I want it to, but that's okay. Do I bother with die, die, die? Or no, let's just work on getting rid of his... His weakness. Okay. Well laid plans. Accuracy, noxious fumes. Caltrops, shiv, shiv. And I'll hold on to die, die, die for the next round. Accuracy... Infinite Blades. I haven't played any attacks this turn. Let's just do Die 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 and Shivs. Now oh, let's hold on to Finisher. I'm taking a lot more hits than I probably should. On a run like this. I guess I didn't need to hold on to Finisher. I don't know. Do I get deflects? Yeah, I'll get deflects. Hello, shop. What do you have for me? Malaise, unceasing top. Or footwork. I mean, footwork's kind of handy. Malaise is helpful. Oh, I can't remove any cards from my deck. I forgot about that. I'm not going to bother with the footwork. It probably would be helpful. Okay, Strength Potion. Yeah, let's grab all of them. I should use more of these potions, honestly. Oh, what I should just do is this. Yeah, we need better energy gen on that first round, though. If I could get the Mummified Hand, we're unstoppable. Okay, escape plan. Backflip. Escape plan. Accuracy. None of them are really gonna hurt me. Concentrate. Caltrops. Shiv, Shiv. He's gonna do a ton of damage to himself. I guess what I could have done was uh, pick the draw potion. Okay, so I can down a bird. Downs one of them. Two accuracies. Defend... This... Hmm. Yeah, I guess I could have done that better. Oh well. Yeah, some of these dailies are a bit harsh. And I, I don't always uh, play my best. So I'll do six damage. Six damage. I could just hella poison him, but that seems wasteful. Let's do this. Suck it, bird. You can't hurt me, but I can hurt you. Ow. I really need to start using, using some of the, these potions. Deflect? I mean, more free deflects would be helpful. Outmaneuver. And a dexterity potion. Probably better than the swiftness potion, considering my energy gen. I don't know. Bad luck. Okay, uh, let's weaken him down. I'm just gonna drink, drink potions here. We're gonna need it. Let's see. So Die 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 will do some damage here. And then I'll do one infinite blades. Which I'm starting to get to the belief that the infinite blades might not actually be that helpful here. They were a good idea, but I don't have the energy gen. Also, I think RNG has just been screwing with me just a little bit. Because, yeah, we need the accuracies to make the ships really worthwhile. Um, and so the infinite blades, I'm just spending a lot of early energy on kind of nothing. And it sucks. 
Well, I should probably do die, 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 no matter what. Kill him. Concentrate. Toss these. Bunch of energy, cut him down a bunch, and shiv him. I'll take one damage. Yeah, I should have gone for the multi malaise earlier, probably. Oh, well. Terror. Set up leg sweep. Quick slash. Leg sweep. Shiv. Hold on to the catalyst. Nah. I mean, I guess it could. It just wouldn't make much of a difference. Hold on to the accuracy. Ow. Oh, he actually did damage there. Damn! Now we should probably just shiv up. I have no means of blocking here. Just hold on to the next accuracy. I got all proud of... Whoops. I guess I could have done bullet time, but I guess it wouldn't have done me any good. Yeah, those free deflects were worthwhile. More malaise? More malaise. I'm just gonna strength down as hard as possible. Okay, so I'm at 31 HP. That's not bad, but we've got a mid-boss immediately following this. So I'm not gonna be... I'm not gonna be stupid. Uh, especially it's because it's these guys. Good. Do I do madness? Do die, die, die. Escape plan. Noxious fumes and outmaneuver. And then take a shit ton of damage. But yeah, uh, just to try and finish the point that uh, I was going to make earlier, I could malaise one down, but it seems like a bad idea given the situation. I'd go for the slaver, but the taskmaster is going to last longer. I don't know if that was a good idea, whatever. A little bit late for that. Yeah, I'm gonna die here. That's fine. I kind of expected it. But yeah, to to finish my thing about, uh, you know, not doing episodes shorter than half an hour or whatever, I just don't get a choice on some of these dailies. Like, yeah, I probably could have played a little bit better there. A lot better there, in fact, considering the score some people manage. Like, oh, damn. But at the same time, this really is just kind of a... Uh, warm-up series for me every day. You know, get up, record, whatever the daily is for Slay the Spire, and then go away. And if that ends up being a little bit short, I'm sorry. But also, like, check out some of my other series. It's not like I'm skimping you guys for content. I'm really not. I'm just winding down on Slay the Spire, at least for now. Maybe I'll come, uh, you know, do a resurgence and be, like, really active about long episodes again. But it, as it stands, I'm just gonna do the daily. Anyway, uh, hopefully that doesn't bug you guys too much. I don't know. Anyway, I'll see you guys in the next episode of Slay the Spire. And as always, thanks for watching.